Okay, so this is uh, CTFD. So that's the platform that we used for, for the event. And so the, the warm up, I'm not going to go too deep into the warm up because I went through, um, you know, during the event. But just for those who are not there, I'm just going to quickly explain what's the solution that we're going to be building today. So this is a, an architecture diagram of the solution. And basically, we're going to be deploying a three tier application to a Docker host, meaning an EC2 instance on AWS. There are going to be three containers, front end, back end and database. Each one of these containers, they're going to run on their own Docker network. And we're just, you know, at the end of this, all, the, all of this task, we should be able to access the front end and be able to log into it and see a bunch of tasks since this is a to-do application. And then for each one of those those tasks, we're going to have to capture the flag. That's why the event is called uh, CTF. And so this is the this is the format of the of the flag. So it's dev slope CTF. And then within the curly brackets, this is the flag that we're going to obtain. So if you're worrying in the event and you're wondering what what are these flags? So this is basically what they are. So every time we submit a flag, I gain points. And that's how we, we had the, the winner. So whoever got points faster. Right. Uh, okay. So I'll submit this one. Yep. So it's already solved. And same thing with the with the getting started. Getting started was just to give everyone access to AWS. I was just explaining how to get access to to Cloud9. And I've already got my my account here. So this is the same interface that everyone had during during the event. And okay. So let's just you know go through it now. The first thing we need to do is to clone the to do application, which is uh, which is on GitHub. So this is the this is the link. So let me just copy this, and we can do. We could do a simple Git clone, but I've already got everything because I've already cloned before. But we just need to do a Git clone, and then if you do ls, we're gonna have a folder called Docker CTF. So I'm just gonna go into that, and you see that everything that is inside the folder environment, it's gonna show up on on the left here. Right. So if I open this, we have the back end, the database and the front end. And, and then at the end, this is pretty much it just it. We're just, you know, going to clone the repo and submit another flag to get five more points. I've already done that. So let's go to to task number one.